Mainong district in Kaohsiung was once known for its thriving oil paper umbrella industry. But after cloth umbrellas started becoming popular in the mid-20th century, most of the paper umbrella makers in the district closed down. One umbrella maker that stayed in business is Guang Jinsheng. This family enterprise, now in its third generation, continues to make beautiful paper umbrellas that attract tourists to the small town. Nestled in the mountains, the rainy town of Mainong saw its umbrella industry flourish during the Japanese colonial period. When we were young during the 50s and 60s, paper umbrellas were just a regular household item. That was the case until the 60s and 70s, when cloth umbrellas arrived. Paper umbrellas came close to disappearing. The only shops left standing were Guangjingsheng and Guangrongxing. In the industry's heyday, Mainong was home to more than 20 oil paper umbrella makers that produced at least 20,000 pieces each year. But as Western cloth umbrellas came into vogue, Mainong umbrellas fell out of favour. Today is left with just one umbrella making house. Back in those days, my father kept telling me I needed to carry on the craft. At the time, I was absolutely opposed to the idea. It's just too tough a job. After a struggle lasting several years, Lin Rong Jun and his wife became the second generation of umbrella makers in their renowned shop. I say that for me, going into this profession is almost a kind of, I feel it was my destiny. It's not something you can control. These days, new tourists and signs of change have begun to appear in Mainong's umbrella industry. Trade alliances have formed, creating more possibilities. In this sleepy town, long-standing craftsmanship has stood the test of time. Both intricate and unadorned, these beautiful handmade umbrellas have turned Mainong into an enchanting place to visit. <laughs>